about Odin trying to follow us to Yodenheim before we get there or whatever. Isn't it a lot simpler if they want us dead because we're gone? And they think we're a threat? I suppose we can't rule it out. But Odin's ways are subtle and his purposes oh. are... Enough about Odin and his whole stupid family. doing too. who's evil. And you know what? Odin's right. We are a threat. Because we know what they are and we know we can beat them. Well, not all of them. Not yet. Magni did his worst. And he's dead. They're no better than us. And they're gonna be sorry they picked this fight. did more than that. Move it, or we'll pick up where he left off. I'll kill you. No. He is beaten. Not worth killing. He should pay for what he said about Mother. I said no. But we're gods. We can do whatever we want. <laughs> That's what I said to your mother right before I gave it to her. What are you doing? This is a much better knife than mother's. You killed against my wishes. 
wishes. You lost control. Haven't you been teaching me to kill? I have been teaching you to survive. We are gods, boy. And that makes us a target. From now until the end of days, you are marked. So I teach you to kill, yes. But in defense of yourself. Never as an indulgence. Nobody cared about him anyways. What's the difference? There are consequences to killing a god! Why? How do you know? How do you know? Watch your tone, boy. Whatever. Why are we going this way? Did we miss something back here? found us. Balder cannot be far. Good. I have a few words for him, too. No, you do not. You will leave him to me. So you can kill him. Because that's what we do to our enemies, right? 
Because he'd do the same to us. I will do only what is necessary. And I'll help. No. Yeah, this room. But we need a new way up. Talking to me? Thought you didn't like my tone. <laughs> you know there's no way up this way, right? Say, what's with you two? All clammed up and scowling? 
It's like you finally noticed everything smells like shit. Well, don't worry. I'm sure they'll be back to yelling at each other momentarily. Hmm. Well, have fun shutting up. Let's sort you out. What you need, kid? And that's the Now you're talking. OK, 
cave, that'll hold you for now. Guess that worked out. What's it gonna be this time? Shorty. What's it gonna be? We got that taken care of.
Well, see you next time you need... Let's get you squared away then. Good to see you sweating the details. Come back soon with more crap you found. Sure, I'm open. Something on your mind, boy? Anything else for you? Son? What'd you forget?
Maybe next time. Brothers, be warned. The tunnels I'm seeing in the walls up here show signs of recent dragon activity. We already killed that dragon. Oh, did you then? Well, how'd that go?
Boy, over here. Whatever.
Guess I'll stop what I'm busy with now. It's almost like having a thick skin. I'm glad I'm still useful to you. I'm glad my expensive tools and stuff can help. Don't need me anymore, huh? I guess I can muster the energy. Wow, he deigns to let me go. What shall it be? You sure you wouldn't prefer Brock help you instead?
Come on, you two. The silence is getting unnerving. Don't worry about it. We're focusing. Nearly there, Mark. Finally. Boy, the room. We made it. Beautiful, isn't it? 
What I remember once. Brother, look out! Miss me. <laughs> Run, boy! Cross the bridge! No! I'm a god too! I can do this! Get off him! Really? Walter, let him go! Take me instead! I'll do whatever you have! Shut up! All this time, I thought I needed you! You're just me. Turns out, the boy is the brains. No! You broke the gate! That was the only way to Yonahai! Stupid son of a bitch! Get out of here, boy. Yes, by all means, Junior, run away. Let Daddy do all the heavy lifting for you. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Let go! Calm down, boy. You are not ready for this. I am ah! ready. And here I thought my family was fucked up. <laughs> oh, your father is right, boy. You are far from ready. Now would you be so kind as to hold this for me? Thank you. Atreus! Activated the bridge! Hey! 
Opens the full weight of Asgard will come crashing down on you. <laughs> it's over. Is it? So be it. Kill them, you know I will. What did you do? Stay still. Are you gonna help me? You will listen to me and not speak a word. I am your father, and you, boy, are not yourself. You are too quick to temper. You are rash, insubordinate, and out of control. This will not stand. You will honor your mother and abandon this path you have chosen. It is not too late. This discussion is far from over. We are here because of you, boy. Never forget that. It's cold. This is hell? Not just hell. Worst place in hell you could have put us. I see a ship. Get us there. It only takes us halfway to Tyr's temple, but at least it gets us far from here. In a thousand mortal lifetimes, the bridgekeeper kept the living out of this place. But now that you've ripped his heart out, here we are. Funny how it all comes around.
was me. But we're gods. We can do whatever we want. Turn away, boy. <laughs> That's what I said to your mother right before I gave it to her. <laughs> it wasn't me. I couldn't have done that. Do not dwell on those thoughts. Not here. Yeah. We must keep moving. Head. What was that? Not just the old and sick come to Helheim, but so do the criminals. Hell must not draw a distinction between us and those whom these visions are meant to torture. How do we stop it? Escape Hell. As soon as possible. I'm not gonna let it bother me. Like you said, Mimir, it was just an illusion. I wasn't there. No. But it is who you have become of late. Look, I know I got us into I will get us out. You will follow orders. But maybe that's not who I am. It had better be. Now let me focus. I don't mean to hurry you, but faster? Let me think. So, I can't feel my fingers. Maybe both wind traps need to be filled?
No. no, I would never stay outside. This. Listen, you, you have no right. I have every right. I am your mother. You had no right, Rich. I can't taste. I can't smell. I can't even feel the temperature of this, this room. Feasting, drinking, women, it's all gone. But you never got to feel pain again. Death has no power over you now. You would rather die? Than never feel again? Yes. Yes. I would rather die. Yes. Take it away, Mom. I can't. Please. Please. Please take it away. It doesn't work like that. In time, you will find me. You will find me. Come on. No. Yes. I won't. Come on. Come on. Ruin my life. Honey, we can figure this out. I promise. Trust me. I know how to. No. <laughs> I never want to see you again. Never. <laughs> Freya is his mother. Why did you keep this from us, Head? Would you believe it slipped my mind? I would not. Uh, I'm at a loss. I assure you I have no reason to keep such a thing a secret. There's the boat. We will speak more of this. Soon.
was that? We must hurry.
Entirely sure this is seaworthy. She will do. Give me space to work. Just bear in mind this boat can only take us part of the way. Tyr's temple is near the top of a tremendous waterfall which, sadly, we are downstream. That means even if we get there intact, we still need to sail up a waterfall somehow. The Vanier built the greatest ship that ever was, and it can fly. Skifplothnir? Yeah, because it was designed to fly. This was not. Nevertheless, this is the boat we have. Perhaps the biggest iceberg I've ever seen. At least the fire's making heat. What now? Dropping it? Give me a fire. So now the sails are loose? Just watch. Sales loose. So now what? Catch the wind. We're floating. In the heat from the fires. We're actually floating. And we're stuck. Not for long. Stay with the boat. I can't believe it. We just met a huge skyline.
Our ship's lodged on this bridge. So I, can't help I said stay on the boat. Staying on the boat. Atreus. I can help? Together now. to get out of here. Face me, father! It is time to end this! Yes, my son. It is time. No. It's that voice again. Do you know who that is? I do not know.
Ed, how long before we reach the temple? Yeah, it's freezing. As long as we maintain this speed and those fires don't go out, we should be there in no time, lad.
you believe? Magic? Or those blades.
that was your plan? You're both cracked! We are leaving this realm. Now! As long as we didn't wreck our way back. It's Odin's. I recognize his atrocious taste anywhere. Look at that! It's the missing panel about here. Odin must have stolen it. But why? He always has his reasons. Might I have a look? Well, this is most unexpected. Why? What does it mean? I haven't the foggiest. Isn't that unexpected? Head. Look, clearly that's Tyr. Traveling somehow. Perhaps magically. But what's that to do with the giants that they should devote a shrine to it? I'm afraid that is none too clear. What are those runes in the corners? Not runes. Symbols from different lands. They mean... War. Aye. How do you... This one I know too well. Oh. His eyes. They are jewels. Like yours. No doubt signifying the gift of sight the giants granted us. Give me a closer look. Interesting. Very interesting. What is that? Secret plans concealed by Tyr so none could access but him. And those few others the giants trusted. And right under Odin's nose. Ho ho ho! I did promise I'd get you to Jotunheim. What do you mean, Ed? You said we were out of options. Don't you see, brother? Odin never gave up hope, and neither should we. He knew there was a clue in here, but we're the ones who found it. These plans are for a key to some chamber Tears kept hidden. I don't know where it's leading or what we'll find, but it's a path. How do we make this key? I suggest we ask a dwarf. I think I know just the door that key goes to. <laughs> Down by the water. This is where Odin brought all his best clues about Yodin. <laughs>
See anything? You did not see me with someone. An old man. What old man? Can we go? Yes. Very well. All right, let's get back to Midgard and see about making that key. Where's that dwarf? Balder is the son of Freya. He is! It's shocking every time I hear it, and yet obviously I know it. When I think about Balder and Freya... I... Yes, lad. <laughs> Freya. How's that, brother? Hey, tell me Balder's vulnerability. Balder is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. Wait, what has happened? He is bewitched not to speak of what he knows. I am? I am! Oh, that's it precisely! I wonder how long that's been so. Since she had my head at her mercy, or back when I figured out Baldur's weakness. I'm here! Yes, lad? You just said you figured out Baldur's weakness. Did I? But Baldur is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. <sighs> Enough. This means there is a way. If he troubles us again, we will find it. Can you make it? Is it a weapon? Armor? Or likewise an instrument of war of which I'm a master at shaping? No? Then forget it. Even if I wanted to make such an insignificant goo I'm liable to chink my tools working on something so Delicate and ladylike. Then shingle it. Pattern weld the item with scap slag. Keep the layers thin. Alternate the overlay. Okay, smart guy. And where do you propose to find a lump of quality scap slag? Last time I saw one, I could still get rigid down south. Shut your mouth. Is that... Where did you... I had to get my hands dirty. <laughs> <laughs> well, don't just stand there. Hey, let's do this. What? You? You're fine with working on something that's not a weapon? Oh, hell, why not? <laughs> what? I can grow too. Oh, watch, watch the spine. Keep your wrist loose. No, oh, you keep your wrist loose. Yeah, I need more heat here. Coming up. You gonna temper that steel longer? You don't need to. I triple quenched it with Drago oil. See, how inventive and sanitary. You clever little beaver. 
Never too late to learn a new trick, is it? <laughs> no, it's not. Yeah. Here it is. Nope. Don't forget this. No, oh, quit your grinning. It's downright unsettling. It's just nice to see you together. But now the rune on your brand looks different. Yeah, price of uh, reforging something what broke. I knew it. You two love each other. Oh, cut it out, Francis. You're gonna get me all weepy. I like the new one better. Don't you? We have work to do. No. Something else we can do for you? No, I just glad you guys worked it out. Ah. Well, I could say the same to you. <laughs> I guess I was getting a bit full of myself. Told him what he needed to hear, how's it sounds to me. Just the same. I'm sorry for how I spoke to you, Sindri. Can you forgive me? Already have. Like you said, it all worked out. Now, let us get back to work before I get... ...sentimental. Come on in, man. No much for peace and quiet. I got plans. What you need, kid? Anything else for you? At least we got that taken care of. Say the word, kid. Something for the boy? Where were we on that other thing?
has got to be for that crazy door downstairs, hidden around the back. Remember? Atreus, follow me. Be right there. Tears ruin. This is it. Place. Your guess is as good as mine, little brother. The tree! We're underneath the realm travel room. But why is the floor on the ceiling? Those realm doors seem to mirror the ones above. Up there. Tyr used the same magic to protect the Black Rune. The clue we seek may be inside. Huh. Right next to the Odinon door. Interesting. But can we reach it? Not from here. One inner sanctum within another. Those tapestries. Looks like more giant. Whatever it's here did for them must have been big. Boy, this is the rune for Jotunheim. That's right. And look, we're on the other side of the door. The upside down door. What are you thinking? Stand back. Okay. It's moving! What's moving? Everything! Thank 
Extraordinary. The whole room is built on some kind of axle. There's chains on both sides. Without those... <clears throat> we can flip the temple. All right! Do you... What now? Statues. I see them. It says void. Hmm. Ominous. Go on. Read. Before the first, after the last. Nothing between, no shadow cast. Oh. Are you quite sure flipping the temple is the only way to reach them, whatever it is? You said there would be a path. The temple can be flipped. Therefore, we flip the temple. The logic is unassailable. sure what happens when we recklessly upend a room that's rooted to eight other realms. I'm curious, of course, but it's a leap to imagine it gets us to your night. I don't mind a leap. Well, who knows? Perhaps you and Tyr are the same kind of mad. An army of statues. I don't think they're the kind that come to life, if that's what you're worried about. Tyr often said that in the world of PC envisioned, the only soldiers he'd need would be statues. Bless his heart, but the bugger did take himself rather seriously, didn't he? 